Hey everybody, this is my review of this tripod which I just bought uh, earlier today and I unboxed. It's called the Small Rig and I have my Sony a7 III on top of it. Um, I find this to be very versatile and high quality. First off, the material. Most of this is metal um, and some parts are plastic, but you have this nice, you know, friction filled grip here. And then there's latches here, like typical tripods to make this taller or shorter as much as possible. I'm currently using it on my own fun amateur photo shoot here. And the things to point out that are a bit different about this is you can basically, you know, move these legs however you want. And then to lock it in, you can latch it. But they also invert um, 180 degrees. So if you wanted these legs to go all the way up and for this to be pointed down, so you get an upside down shot, you could do that. Um, and then you can extend this, this base here uh, probably up to about here. Um, I'm using this right now in the desert botanical garden to take some uh, cacti shots. And um, another thing unique about this is there's a few turns here. And then you have one, two, three uh, air bubble levelers to make sure it's level. Um, but yeah, one of these here, this one here allows you to turn this 360 degrees. And then you can loosen or tighten this. Um, then there's one here which allows this to kind of rotate however you want. Um, and so there's that one. Um, and then there's one I'm not sure what it does. Actually, this is the one that allows it to rotate. This is the one I'm not sure what it does. Um, but I don't really need too much out of it. And then if I move over here... Um, there's just another one here that I'm not sure what it does. Oh yeah, this one here. Um, so this one, if you loosen it, it allows for this little uh, rectangle to pop out, which allows you to just screw it onto the camera so that you can just move the camera and that rectangle and latch it back onto here. How it works is it, it's basically a clasp. So then when you tighten it, it collapses it. And then when you loosen it, um, the front and uh, backwards ends kind of separate apart, which loosens the grip on the rectangle in the center. So generally, it's a pretty solid product. Um, these are the things that kind of latch these legs in. So if you flip them open, it will loosen, which will collapse one of the legs. You can also unscrew one of these legs here. And then... Uh, attach this directly to the base, turning it into a hiking stick, which is apparently a feature that they offer. Um, I don't know why you would use that. Maybe you're trying to hike, but you want the camera on top there. Um, but generally, I think it's really good. You know, when you pack it up, you collapse these legs up onto the base, and then you just pack it in this little thing here, which you carry on your shoulder. It's actually really, uh, versatile so I'm just gonna loosen this a bit just to show you what I mean okay that's the wrong one that that would have loosened this and would have dropped the camera which would have broke it so we don't want to do that I'll uh, go ahead um, this is the one that we care about so if we loosen this let me just uh, okay so it's it's already a bit loosened and now I can kind of adjust this as I see fit before okay now i'm going to tighten it again so i don't screw it up but yeah that's basically the camera um and yeah i basically use it as a standard tripod so no fancy stuff here but you know if i want this level i can level it with this here and then the other ones here because there's uh air bubbles on this side and yeah that's basically how it works it's it's really solid and these extend pretty far, so you can get up to like five to six feet of height.